I was not ready in the slightest. In the slightest. In the slightest. Hi, Lucifer. Was not ready in the slightest. It's okay. Hi, Dakota. Hi, Mobile Gaming, and hi, MTG. All right. Now things are set up. You know, I really don't imagine a lot of people are going to pull today. I think it's a terrible idea. Like, I think everybody should pull, but I don't know. Hey, Mr. H2O. I really think everybody should be pulling. Is Monkey King getting a buff? He's getting an update. Whether or not is it is a buff remains to be seen. Alright, so I have one... Should I just say screw it and pull? I only have three copies. Hi, Kalpa. Uh, I really don't need to pull, but I figure I could if I wanted to. I could just pull for the hell of it. Hi, kitty. I've got... I have enough. I don't have as many as I would like, but oh well, you know, we'll make it work. We will make it work. And the f so I guess for now, while we wait for people, if anybody is pulling even, like community pulls have not been all that popular lately. Whoops, that actually is should not be there. Let me remove that text. Community pulls have definitely not been all that popular lately. And unfortunately, I can kind of agree with that because just luck has not been good lately. Luck really has not been good lately. So, high prejudice. Like, keys have been miserable. Keys have been absolutely miserable. And so, it's just, it's just terrible. Just, just terrible. Alright, so, we're going to try and finish Heroic Ruins with just shards. Skull, Bale, Sigor, Brin... Well, that's not the point. The point is that, like, the, the odds have been bad on keys lately. Now... They messed up the odds, and instead of 4%, now we're getting like 2.8% on 5 stars, and that's just unacceptably low. So, oh well. Now, I don't mind being a sacrifice if nobody wants to pull today. Hey, Tyrael. I don't really care. Man, I feel like I'm not going to do all that well on Heroic Runes right now. Oh, jeez. There's a lot of stuff here. Opinions on the Monkey King rework? So, what's going to happen, most likely, is that his revive will now go off even if he has Azathoth. And then, that, honestly, is so minor that it doesn't even matter. That is not an issue because... Um, Bryn will still stop it. That's for sure. And then... I guess they're going to improve his control, which seems crazy because his Petrify is actually really high. If I recall, his Petrify percentage is like 50%. Uh, Tyrael, that's actually pretty normal. That's pretty fair odds I would say it's not great but it's not unreasonably bad oh geez I have a lot of those wow my five my three stars are bad four percent I mean regular odds is six point nine percent you're not so far off that it's unreasonable we'll say that so I finished undead. 
Mm. I kind of feel like I don't want to fodder your Saizo to make Viv. It's up to you. If you think you will never use Saizo, then you might as well do it. I would like to keep most copies of rare heroes that may or may not someday be useful again. And so even though I got rid of my Yig, I still keep 9 copies. Like, I keep copies around. So even though I don't have a Yig anymore, I still have 2 plus 7. Even though I don't have Monkey King, I still have copies. So, personally, I prefer to keep stuff around, but, you know, everybody plays a little bit differently. I think I benefit from being able to save. I didn't food Saizo intentionally. Emo, you have absolutely no damage. You should rethink that strategy. You really need some damage. Alright, let's see where I'm at on this. Ah, oh, one alliance, two horde. Where am I supposed to get these? One alliance, two horde. Okay. One alliance, two horde, what was left? One elf, and then have both heaven and hell. One elf, two heaven. Detlaf is not good high end. One elf, two heaven. Okay, so let's see. One elf. Uh, two heaven and one hell. I probably will pull. Do I want to build Monkey King? I. You remember I used to have one, right? I used to have a T4. I just broke him down so that I could make someone else. Alright, so we finished that. If I was going to pull, that was a bad idea. But whatever. YOLO! Maybe pulling all of those made me be able to fuse something. Nope. Uh, finishing the 6 star fuse is hard. The new artifacts could be interesting, but they could also be really dumb. The fact that they're putting... Uh, the fact that they're putting... Um, a mythic version of Dragon Ring. Oh, I don't even have one. I don't even have one to look at. Like, this artifact is not good. Who needs a mythic of this? We don't need that. How do I use my Wolf Rider? I have shown off how to use my Wolf Rider, actually. Let me show you how it works. Rushi, you keep it. Rune stays the same, level stays the same, gear stays, all of that. Let's see here. Here is... Hi, Jack. Here is how you use Wolf Rider. Take a look at this. If you don't have Wolf Rider, this level is actually much harder. So Wolf Rider makes Trial 197 much, much easier because he helps you kill Verthandi much faster. And because she's so critical to that beating that level, it helps a lot. They are releasing two artifacts. Let me show those. I should have probably saved a picture of them. Let me... I should have saved a picture, but I didn't. Oh, wait. I know where I can get a picture of it. Come on, load. Actually, they're kind of dumb looking. Okay, so... Let's see here. Where did I... Where did my folder go? Come 
Come on, where is it? Here we go. Here is the two new artifacts. They are called Eternal Flame and Eye of the Storm. But we have absolutely no idea what either of them do. So, for now, just look at them. I think they look kind of dumb. They're... I really would have liked something more creative than that, but oh well, whatever. So those are the two new artifacts that are coming out, and again, we do not know what they do. So we will all find out together later. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna pull. YOLO. Lindbergh with Wolf Rider? Someday. I have too many that I want to do. I really just have too many that I want to make. Oh, wait. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna regret this hundred greatly, but you know what? YOLO. Freya or Viv second after Bryn? Definitely Viv. What? Son of a... Okay, we'll try that again. 77, or 100 even. Do I have Lindbergh? I do not. Alright, let's go. Let's see how ridiculous this is. I really would love a Brin, but... 450 advanced token... It's 500. It says 500, actually. You can see that. It says 500. So I'm not really close. Alright, let's go. I don't really know how... I know how this is going to go. This is going to go very badly. But that's okay. You know what? YOLO. Let's do this. Yep. Oh, wait. Oh, that is two heaven, one hell. That is all shards. Uh, Wish Star, I don't know. I might save for a Tears of the Goddess or something. Wow, this is horrible. That's not even a 5 star. Yeah, I knew how this was going to go. I knew how this was going to go. And you know what? I saw this coming. Belial... I saw this coming. That's okay. I probably will be smarter and not pull next time. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's my five. That's my shiny. Hi, my unk. Oh, my God. That was so bad. That was so bad. I walked right into that. Yeah, I walked right into that. Uh, emo, that's because I was pulling on two different accounts. It was 300 on one account and 200 on another. Man. That's so bad. They have not released a gift code since the anniversary event. I wouldn't worry too much about gift codes. They come and go. Is this open? This is open, right? Watchmen is not that good. Alright, let's see here. How many fights are there? A lot. Alright, then we're just going to go power on through. We will power on through. How do I want to do this? Eh, whatever. 
just power on through. Yeah, so this was not a community pull at all, huh? New event after Themis? We don't know. You are way too soon. Like, we barely know next week, and you want the week after that already. That's kind of ridiculous, to be honest. Jeez. Ah, uh, this. Oh wait, no, Hawkeye Master. Okay, that's a decent one. China is flooding right now. There's there's a bunch of places that are flooding. There's like multiple states in the U.S. that are flooding too. Shall we call today like a short stream? Mage Assassin. Nope, these are not useful. Monkey King will be good again? I don't think so. The thing is, even if you increase his, his Petrify or something, he still doesn't do anything for your team. He doesn't work with anyone. He doesn't, he doesn't make anyone better. He doesn't have good teammates. He doesn't do anything. Unless they make his skill hit everybody or something, or they create they change his petrify, I st I just don't think that he's all he's gonna be all that useful. Yeah, okay, I'll take these. Why would he work with Freya? I did not complete peaks yet. I can do peaks after this. I don't really want to do peaks, but... Oh, whoops, I forgot to go for this. Oh, well, whatever. If, if I'm not... If I'm not particularly aiming to complete it with anything special, then... Whatever. <gasps> yes! Alright, we good. We gonna do some good damage today. The Chinese server is also based around the double pet. Remember that. We don't have the double pets yet. And the double pets are going to be changing. They will not be the same as... Uh, whatever they have is not going to be the same as what we have. Because Olivia's wand is not star shards. It looks similar, but it's not the same. It's just a regular hexagon or a six-pointed star. It is not star shards. The one that does have star shards is this one. She has thus is actually star shards on her head because by the lore, Lorelei is a physical version of star shards. That's why she gets the energy. Which, if you think about it, doesn't really explain why Yig has energy, but... Uh, Hua... Well, someone like Vivienne would be nice. Valkyrie would be okay. Freya would be okay. I mean, Brynn, Sig would be great. Brynn will come in the monk Moonstone shop with pets? Most likely, yes. I've been saying Brynn's gonna be a a couple months out and you know that's really about where it's gonna be so the next time that there is a major update is probably when Bryn is getting added to the moonstone shop all right oh hey nice they gave me this one cool I got great runes this time I got really great runes this time all right your buffs are extra damage to bleeding and has silence all right whatever so, I'm going to do this outside of this because I have started battles against this guy by accident way too many times. Way too many times. Do I not have a... Alright, there we go. Two Vivians is why I failed trial. 
Why did I fail trial? What are you talking about? I didn't fail anything. Okay, let me see. Okay, I'll go with that. And if you're talking about failing the alliance only, it's really hard for me to fail the alliance only when I already finished it. So, I, I don't really understand the... Two veg and two viviennes. Uh, that was moonlight, so that one's just very hard, period. Because you can't cleanse any crowd control. Like, I couldn't use Skuld. I tried very many versions, and the problem, it just wasn't an easy... It just wasn't really a doable battle. Okay, so... Change this one to this. Is this the right monkey... Nope, it's not the right Vegvis here. Monkey King rework will be okay. We'll see how it goes. I don't think he's going to become much any more amazing. And so bleed, burn, poison. I should be good. All right, let's go. I for No, I didn't. Okay. Whew. I thought I forgot my runes for a sec. That would have been really bad. Man, look at that. Look at Arwen doing 29 million damage on a regular attack. I mean, I hope I don't eat my words. And I'm perfectly willing for Monkey King to become good. Hey, Graydon. If he becomes good, then so be it. Gosh. Is she doing 18 million on skill or 185 million? She could be doing 18. She could be doing 185. I really can't tell. I think that's 190 million. Uh, Shelder, it's probably better you weren't in that guild anyway, then. I don't like this silence thing he's doing. Oh well, what can I do? Monkey King replace Veg? See, that's tough, because remember that Veg also increases your damage. Holy cow! What the? I have never done that much damage before! I have never done this much damage before. Wow. Wow. That's pretty amazing. That is actually really amazing. That is my personal record. Anyway, also, Monkey King still only petrifies the back line, so unless they're completely changing that, we'll see what happens. Alright! Alright! So, anyway, now that I've done that, you go away, you go away. We're gonna keep you, and we're gonna keep you. And Sigurd does not need energy, so we're gonna give Sigurd a bone... Mm, bone grip? Bone grip, bone grip, bone grip. No, he doesn't need bone grip. We're gonna give him... Hmm. We'll give him bone grip. Okay. Does MK petrify when he gets attacked? No, he doesn't, I believe. I do not believe he has that passive. Oh, I know what I need. Okay, so Chessia is going to keep a 44 warrior. Oh my god, has she had that this entire time? Oh, whoops. 
Okay, well, whatever. All right, here we go. So this is actually a very annoying battle to keep doing over and over because you can't always stop his first skill. Hi, Nathan. And that's a problem. Oh, wait a minute. So I need... No, Mulan bleeds, so... Like, I will... Mulan will... Or Arwen will always be doing an extra 77% damage to that. So, this is great. What am I building next? I haven't decided. I have a lot of heroes that I want to build. I kind of want... I mean, I want a third skull. I want a second Hodor. I really want a second Hodor, actually. He's proving to be really amazing. Double Brin. You know Double Brin's not that good? Alright, anyway. So, this team we know works. Works really great. 10 Verathondi for T4 Detlaf. That's fine, but make sure that you know you're never going to build Verthondi. She is still really good. Alright, so 3. We're going to count. 4. Ooh, that was only 140. 5. His buffs aren't that big, so I actually should be able to do pretty good damage. Six. Seven. Ooh, that was 180. Eight. Like, to anyone that wants to do damage to this boss, if you don't have an energy denial team, you can't do this kind of damage without... Unless you have also the, like, the Mythic Scroll. Was that... Shoot, was that 10? Oh, someone died. So I did 10. Mulan, everyone died. So that would put me at 3.1 billion? 3.1 billion. I would absolutely build a second Sigurd. So 3.1 billion damage. That's also a personal record. Man, there's just no way to beat Bold. It really is not possible. Man! So, I guess community pulls are just dead, huh? I don't mind that. I don't mind not doing community pulls anymore. But they were more fun than team critiques, which I forgot this week. Bold does have an infinite team. His infinite team is probably better than mine. Because he has three skulls. If you pulled for Sigurd, you should still be able to pull one round. I I just don't know what I want to pull right or what I want to make first. I've got so many things that I want to make. Oh, I have a lot of heaven. Ultima is an idea. Is definitely an idea. If I was to choose one T4 for free, probably Brin. Probably Brin. Squalzy, if you think that someday you will do Podor. It's better to pull than not pull, but if you're unsure, then probably you should wait. It 
Did I raise Yig or Watchman? I leveled both of them to like T1 and then I got rid of them. Watchman got converted, Yig got converted. Yeah, Yig got converted. I don't think anybody's pulling today. Well, Vanith, if you want to pull, you're welcome.